just going to go through how you can check to make sure that your item description is compatible with mobile phones and tablets and the like. You have to put new code in with uh, eBay's new guidelines. You can't have any active content and the coding that's in your item description, the HTML code, has to be able to fit onto mobile phone screens, tablet screens and all different types of screens. You can see here I have got my Penguin mug up for auction on my eBay account and further down the page you can see my item description which I have written the code myself and this is how my item description looks at the moment. If we scroll up slightly to where we've got the eBay item number and we grab the eBay item number and copy it we find this web page you can actually see the web address here which is iways.net mobile friendly EN UK if you're based in the UK it's the mobile friendly test we paste the number into this box down here and then we select check now obviously if you're in the eBay UK that's correct so we just check now it goes to this new page. It takes a few minutes to go through the checks. What it's doing is making sure that your code for the AB description, the item description, is compatible and is it you it will be able to be shown on screens as small as mobile phones, moving up to tablets and then onto laptops and computers. You can see here my old code, the code that I've written, is non-compatible. The content is wider than the viewport width and it has thrown all these errors. I used to put videos on my uh, item description and videos are classed as active content. You see here I haven't got any, my the, as far as active content is concerned I am fine but if I'd had a video on my item description this would have thrown an error here as well for having a, a video one but I haven't actually got one so you can see here that it's not compatible with mobile phones on this side of the page here you can see what it would look like on a mobile phone and you can see it's off to the side there isn't enough room on the mobile phone I haven't got my code set up for it to be shown on a mobile phone properly so to amend this we go back to my listing I go up to revise my item, click on revise item, it takes you to the revision page for your item, scroll down to my item description where the item description has been entered in, this is what it's shown in as a standard, go to the HTML, this is the old code that I had entered in for the actual item description that you've seen previously. So we would just highlight all the code and get rid of it. I go down here and you can see the new code that I have written. It has got meta name, viewport, and this is the new CSS type of code that you need to enter so that it tells your item description what kind of screen it's going to be shown on. I just copy the whole code try that again copy drop that down to there paste into the HTML and you can see the new code and you can see in here that I have got a video this is a video that was previously put into this although this is the code for the CSS for the viewport and for the metadata so I go down and revise listing 
with displayed fees. You can see here I've got the item number. My item's just been relisted with that new code. I copy the number, the item number for the for the revised listing that I've just revised. Go back up to the mobile friendly test. We go to the bottom and just put the number back in, paste and recheck, check now. Again it goes through the checks to see it takes a little time to analyse the actual content and the item description. Content width is non compatible, and we have got mobile incompatible plugins, which is the video. So, the actual video content is throwing everything off because we have we still have got this wider because the actual video is being shown on the item description. So, we'll go back up. back on the item, revise, go back down, it's the new code, so we go to the HTML code and we take out the object width and the object, delete that, take away one of the breaks and we go back down to the bottom, revise listing with fees, again we copy the item number item we have just revised. We go back up to the mobile friendly test and we re-enter the number again. Check now and hopefully we should all have green on all the items on the check checklist. And there you can see because I've moved removed the video off the item content, we now have an optimized item description which can be shown on a mobile phone, tablet, and such like. That is basically how you make your content adaptable to the new eBay rules for showing on mobile phones and on tablets. I have the code here. If you want a copy of this code, then just email me or message me or whatever. And it's quite simple to change the actual code on the item description. When you're revising your listing, all you need to do when you're revising your listing, all you need to do when you're in the, the revision state, all you need to do is just treat this like an, a normal template where you can manipulate all the text to the way that you want it uh, in your item description. And that basically is how to check your eBay item description to make sure it meets the new eBay rules for mobile, tablet and laptop friendliness uh, being shown on the screen. Hope this has helped. Bye just now.